Behind the mists of Madagascar lie some of the most mysterious parks in the world, with 16,000 hectares of tropical forest, a veil behind which flourish species found nowhere else in the world. But if you want to see them, you have to follow their sounds. It's via these strange cries that the residents of this forest communicate. Finding their source can take hours of walking. There are some lemurs going by here somewhere. Six lemurs are clinging to this branch. The species is usually unseen in daylight as they're nocturnal. But there are 14 other species in this park, many of which can be spotted in the day. These small primates who live hidden in the treetops are the treasure of Madagascar. They live no other place on Earth. Jean Etienne Toto is one of the guardians of this sanctuary. For 20 years, he's guided tourists in the forest. Looking for its inhabitants, he can decipher their calls. There's a call of fear, a cry of alarm. Mm. He continues like that, wah, 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 like that. That's to alert the group and the normal call, that's fwif, fwif. It's like that. Among all the lemurs in the park, one is the star of the show, who everyone wants to see. It's the Indri Indri, the biggest lemur in the world. An adult can measure up to 70 centimetres and can live up to 80 years with a family life almost like our own. They live in small families. They have babies every two or three years with one mate for life. They stay alone when they've lost their mate. It's impossible to capture the Indri Indri. No zoo has this species. To keep it from disappearing, Madagascar preserves its forests, but the island has lost 80% of it in a single century. 43 parks are now protected to keep a flora and fauna among the richest in the world.